Hey guys, I told you that I was going to make a Hunger Games video, and lately I've seen like a lot of people doing like clove ones, and a lot of people doing the main characters, and um, I don't think that main characters are really good, and I do like that they aren't doing that, but I'm thinking, why don't we try another character? So, um, I'm looking at a picture right now of District 7's tribute female tribute and uh so she has like this um kind of she does get mistaken for another tribute in there and uh it's kind of like a lot of people think that she's wearing a braid and that's what i thought at first but she's not so what you actually want to do first just have her hair by the side and um it looks like she has she has some of her bangs on Besides, I don't really have that. I don't have things. So, yeah. And it looks like she started it from the back. So, what you're going to do is start just like a ponytail. And, um, just do any. So, just do like a little ponytail. I'm sorry, I'm not really using the same hair bands because <clears throat> I don't really have black or brown hair bands. So, it's going to be. So if it kind of bothers you that I'm using different ones, but I'm just using a random hairband that I just found. I have like a hundred hairbands, and right now, and all my hairbands, just yeah. And so she puts it kind of to the side, and what you're going to do is um, what you're going to want to do is get another hairband. And what she does is she kind of stops it. She puts the hairband right here. And it's not like, it's a very small hairband. And yeah, it kind of looks like this, but she has it kind of fluffy. A little bit on the fluffy side. So, kind of like poofed out. But I see, can't you see how some of the hair is now sticking up? You'd use like hairspray or gel to do that. To get rid of that part, and I'm gonna use okay, and it gets like natural puffy, and try and make them even. I can't make mine even right now, and I guess people call these biker braids. Um. So, yeah, people I guess call them biker braids. Now, since she has kind of longer hair than me, so, yeah, she has longer hair than me, so she has, or she has kind of shorter hair, longer hair, and what her hair actually goes, like, right here, but I had my hair cut, so yeah. And when you see it, she's showing three of these. So right now, this is kind of, she has three rubber bands. So, yeah, I would usually stop it at right here. So, wait, let me back up. I would usually stop it. Now, I would stop it right here. But then again, I can start, I can keep going. But if I do, I'd have, like, this little piece of hair right here. So, I'm just going to keep it like that. I can also make these bigger. So, what you're going to kind of want to do right now is just puff those out a little bit. Or you can just leave that the same. I like to do that. I like to pop it out. So that's how you do the District 7 hair tribute. Um, it's not that different from just a regular tribute from, you know, it's not very hard to do. And in the morning you can do it. It's very simple. And I like this hairdo also because I love, I kind of like the hair. I'm, I don't really like having my hair down. Or, yeah, I don't like it in my face. So, I guess I do this hair do a lot. And just to give you a look, if you do another one, I'm going to do another one. Just to give you guys a look. This is how it would kind of look. I'm sorry, see? Look, it's very... So, I'm just going to kind of leave it like this. And that is how you do the District 7 female hair. And I'll do a few more of extras. So, bye.